alert. The following terms are used in this video. Adsorption, pyrolysis, molecules, VOCs, H2O, gram porosity, vascular char, phase changes, chemisorption, acid gas. Some are defined, all are offered by a friendly chemist. How carbon becomes filter media and why Sentry Air uses coconut carbon and how we customize it. All biological systems that we're aware of are primarily based on carbon. The purpose of creating activated carbon is to create an environment that promotes adsorption. Adsorption, a thin layer of molecules adheres to a solid or a liquid. Activated carbon can be produced from any sort of organic material uh, available. However, some feedstocks are more suitable than others. Nutshells, peat, wood, and various petroleum byproducts are typical starting materials for producing activated carbon. By heating the material in an oxygen deficient environment, you break down the more complex organic molecules as well as cause phase changes from solid to liquid and liquid to, liquid to gas that helps to liberate the various organic compounds in the, in the feedstock material as well as the water. Releasing this material gets rid of a lot of the weight of the original feedstock material, so much so that it takes 300 pounds of feedstock material to create 60 pounds of activated carbon. Plant matter is an excellent feedstock material for activated carbon because of its vascular system, composed of tiny pores and pathways leading throughout the material. The porous vascular structure expands during pyrolysis and the activation process, thus reducing the material's weight and increasing its porosity. Porosity, being full of pores. Due to the coconut shell's hardness, activated carbon produced from it uh, is much harder and more durable than other feedstock materials. So uh, this leads to less adsorbent loss due to attrition, as well as less generation of dust and particulate during material handling. Century Air Systems uses 100% virgin coconut shells as the feedstock material for our activated carbon. How we customize carbon filters for our customers. Activated carbon works very well with large organic molecules, but it struggles with smaller organic molecules and uh, inorganic chemicals, such as uh, uh, sulfur dioxide, hydrogen sulfide, mercury, iodine, and strong acids, which are used very heavily in industry. We make a specialty treated carbon uh, that works via a process related to adsorption called chemisorption. Chemisorption, adsorbed substance held by a chemical bond. Some customers have uh, multiple potential respiratory hazards. To combat this, we design special filter media blends uh, to suit their application. This process includes evaluating the hazards present and determining the relative quantities of each chemical to be treated. Uh, then we specify a blend ratio for the custom filter. Um, a popular configuration is our blended carbon and acid gas filter, which many labs find very effective um, at reducing fumes and vapors from organic solvents such as acetone and strong acids such as hydrochloric acid.